A man named David Susskind came along, and I had known David for many years, and he was the genius of television in those days. And he had an organization that, uh, that was encouraging women to go into television. There weren't any women producers in those days, but David hired me. Uh, most of the women were either researchers or ideas people or read scripts. And David hired me and asked me to watch television and give him a, a critique of what I saw on the air, the kind of thing that I thought would be better to do. As a result of that, he started a program called The Open End, and he used to do that on Sunday nights. And one day, I watched a program that was called The Women. It was the first time a show had been done on television about women. And it was done on CBS, and the executive producer was a man named Irving Gitlin. And the amazing thing about this ridiculous program <laughs> was that the man was a producer, the writer was a man, the researchers were men, the director was a man, the Every, the, the lighting guy, the <laughs> cameraman, everybody connected with that program was a man, and they were holding forth about women. And so the result of that, I think, was ridiculous. And David said to me, write me a really good essay about that. And I wrote five pages. And he took it to Irving Gitlin, who was his best friend. And Irving invited me to come to a meeting. And I, it was held in a conference room at CBS. And the entire staff that worked on this woman show was sitting there, and he introduced me and said, this woman has ripped us up the back, and I love her for it, because everything she said about this program is correct. And he said, will you come to work for me at, N at CBS? Was he at CBS or NBC? He was at CBS then. Mm -hmm. And he said, I am being groomed to go to NBC because someday they think I could make a great president of the news department. So I was hired by Irving Gitlin and two months later I was brought to NBC.